Hi, I'm Fernando Pereira, and today I will discuss an experiment as part of the Compilers Lab seminar that happens every other week. The goal of this experiment is to answer this research question. What's the asymptotic complexity of CFG Grind in practice? CFG Grind is a tool that runs on top of Valgrind, and it reconstructs the CFG of programs by observing the execution of them. And yes, we say CFG Grind, not CFG Grind. This is our experimental setup. We are running experiments on an Intel Xeon E5 running at 2.4 GHz with 16 GB of RAM. The operating system is Linux CentOS 7.5 and we'll be using two collections of benchmarks. CBench with 32 programs and SPEC CPU 2017 with 43 programs. Each result that I will show comes from the execution of five samples. We report arithmetic means. We are not removing outliers. This is the first result. We are comparing the runtime of the programs instrumented with CFG Grind on the y-axis and the runtime of no Grind, which is Val Grind without any instrumentation on the x-axis. That's the result for CBench. We can see some pattern that that relates the two li axes linearly, but the correlation is not easy to see yet. However, when we add SPEC CPU 2017, it's clear that we have a line. The coefficient of determination is 0.9. That's a very strong indication of a linear relation. Now let's see what happens if we compare the number of executed instructions, or fetched instructions if you must, instead of the runtime of the base programs. We are, we are counting how many instructions have been fetched when executing each benchmark. These are the results for CBench. We can see a bit of a, a line there, but that's not very easy to see again. And, however, when we add spec, the line becomes way clearer, and the coefficient of determination is 0.989 almost a perfect linear relation. 1.0 would be the maximum. So to answer the question, there is indeed a strong linear correlation between the number of instructions executed in a program and the overhead that CFG Grind imposes on this program. This correlation is also true if we count the number of uh, instructions fetched or the runtime of the original program. For those interested, CFG Green is available in GitHub. If you have more questions about this experiment, please don't hesitate to ask me.